This isn't the third time I've cut out. What do you mean? Everything just died. What do you mean? I don't think if if it if the stream dies again, I'm just gonna not stream. <laughs> Because it seems to just be dying over and over again. Cause I don't think my internet likes the fact that, uh, that I'm streaming. Which is weird because I'm playing at a time where no one is like doing anything. Except for my sister. And that's it. But for some reason, I'm having internet con issues. Internet con issues. That's a new word I just made up. If it happens again, I'll just not want stream. Why am I going to block? <laughs> All right. Oh, the tree grew. Uh, yeah, it totally didn't, you know, die again. <laughs> Keeps in between that. Bruh. Where's the grazing bench? It's in the tree. There's water here. I'm pretty sure if I remove this water, then it's basically gone forever. Oh no, I can buy a thing. Okay. And yeah, I'm gonna main sky skyblock leaderboard. Let's go. <laughs> what would that even be? I guess it's just who has the most money. Can I buy a couple? There are a thousand- Okay. So I can just buy a bucket. Okay, I guess an apple is 50 coins and a beetroot is 3. That makes sense. It actually does, because beetroot takes like 30 seconds to grow. A hundred coins for one block of dirt. So yeah, just grief. <laughs> that won't get you banned at all. Make a, I don't know, like a little. Can I sell cobble? I'm pretty sure I can sell cobblestone. I can't sell cobblestone. <laughs> That's the bare minimum. War. Well, growing crops on high, high pixel in, in Cubecraft Skyblock is way fucking different. Some crops take upwards of many hours, if not days, to grow, which is fun. That's su super, super fun.
Alright. Time to dig out. Fucking... Okay, let me actually put this in the correct slot. I'm assuming they haven't changed any of the mechanics that were before. I'm pretty sure they're just the exact same. And if they changed anything, it's probably just bug fixing. Although, speaking of bugs, um, Deepcraft had a community talk yesterday at it. I think it was. Well, for me, it would be at. It was at 2 p.m., which was right as school ended, which was a problem because I do my homework. So I missed a little bit of the talk. But it was basically like them asking the community, what the fuck do you want with CubeCraft? Because at, for a super long time, they were basically not necessarily like ignoring Bedrock. They were definitely developing, their, you know, all, games were being made and shit. But some of the more prominent bugs, they even admitted that like they kind of just, like, didn't deal with them because they thought that the community was patient. And even though, yes, we were, you know, we were still kind of pissed at, at some of the very obvious bugs that were here since the start, like the KB bugs, or knockback bugs, where if you just stand at the edge of the block, you don't take knockback, which is considered technically bug abuse, but at the same time, that's just how knockback works. So it's causing problems for their uh, player reports. It's. This is, I think this is one of the first times where they actually like talked openly with the community. Not to say that they haven't talked with them before, but this, this is more like they listened quicker and they saw what we were all were asking. Which obviously some people were being dicks and were just saying stupid shit. Which some of it was funny, some of it wasn't. Uh, but they. A lot of people really want knockback to be like 1.8 Java, which is basically just all knockback is the same, but it's really fucking wonky. And someone, I think so, I need to check, but someone suggested something that I really liked because currently they have it to where you take less knockback the more you get hit in midair or something like that. Which I never even fucking realized that, that was a thing until they said that. And I'm like, oh shit. That's. I mean, oh, okay. I never knew that because I thought it was just knockback being fucking inconsistent. Even though it is supposed to be consistent. But apparently that's what it is. And some people want knockback to be like the hive. And, um. No, because one, it's fucking sucks. Like, it's, at a at an opinionated standpoint, I hate Hive's knockback simply because it's just up. You just take up a knockback. Barely any horizontal knock. It's just all vertical up. Which makes comboing stupid easy. And so sweats become more sweatier. Not a lot of skill is involved aside from CPS. That can also be argued for just... Minecraft PvP in general, but for stuff like, I think, because it's, it's, strafing is not required. I mean, it never is required, but strafing is something that's really useful, but then on the hive, you just hit someone and they go, like, one block up, so you can just continuously hit them with your better ping and higher CPS. No strafing required, straight line. And that gets annoying for mobile players, because fucking I can't. <laughs> it's, it's, mobile players are just always at a disadvantage. They're, they're always just ass cheeks. So I, I don't... It's very hard to battle. And it's... If everyone on here was a console and PC player, it would be so easy to balance, but because that's not a thing and probably never will be, it's very hard to make knockback both fair and enjoyable, especially because everyone plays a different type of device. I don't really blame the devs for not dealing 
with knockback quicker because they were afraid of the kind of chaos that might ensue. Because some people argue that they're used to the knockback so they don't want it changed. I'm one of those people. It's not that I don't want it changed, but I'm just really used to it. I'm just used to how it works. Uh, but I'm okay with it being changed because I can just get used to that. Yeah, I'm pretty decently active on there. Should I mine this or should I just leave it like that? Usually I just mine under this to get all the stone because the stone generators suck. Also have a lot of dirt. Which I never... I never got. I don't think I ever had enough dirt on my solo world. Or solo skyblock. I don't think I'll mine... I don't think I lose items, right? Yep. Mine right up to there. That's not where I wanted to be. <laughs> yeah, I, I lost. I lose nothing. I don't have anything of worth. <laughs> That's. <laughs> Wasted wood. I, I keep. I'm just doing one block higher at this point. There you go. That's where I wanted to be. I think. Yeah, basically. Alright, time to fuck. And like, probably in an hour just mining cobblestone. Because I am a tidy bitch. Actually, I could... Yeah, I'll just... I'll basically just mine... Like a level. Oh. Yeah, the Sentinel anti chi has been banning quite a few people. I think I've caught a few people got banned on stream by Sentinel. <laughs> and people were memeing, memeing on it, being like, Oh my god, it is real! The prophecy! It's not a ghost! Which, to be fair, it technically didn't even exist on Bedrock. Or it barely existed. Like, it was so low-tech to where it just didn't really work. Now they have it, and they're working on it. Thing is that I'm pretty sure the Cubecraft dev team really wants to just make it like the Hive because it's the easiest thing to do. The Hive's knockback is only changed because of like one single file. You can legit change the vertical knockback, the up and down knockback, with just the file. But for the horizontal knockback, it requires quite a bit of coding apparently, and that takes time. So they could just go the easy route and fucking make it like the Hive. Which no one, well, actually, a lot of people want that, but I'm pretty sure that just, I don't know. I hate it. <laughs> I think a lot of people would hate it too. A lot of people would like it, a lot of people would hate it. It would cause some weird balance to where a huge part of the community would leave and a huge part of it would join back or something. Place some tr trees on here because I need wood. That's not a good spot. I'll just place one.
Oh, and for the knockback, even though it was the most important thing, I probably should have said it first. They are planning on, if it happens, have a beta game, most likely on Sky Wars, where they will just test out knockback. Like they'll have weird things to test out on there, and anyone can just play it. And my first thought was beta Sky Wars knockback leaderboard. <laughs> uh, but then I was like, I don't think that would actually be fun because the knockback would change every like day or something or every week. So that would be inconsistent. But honestly, that would be pretty fun to just like, just to play on that, just to have the different types of knockback and to also like give criticism. And most people probably won't give criticism, but and I probably won't too. I'll probably just be too lazy to do it. Um, Another thing that I think, I think they discussed it, I, don't, I wasn't paying too much attention, I was doing something else. They were discussing private games, uh, and like how, they, I think some people thought that private games were a thing on Java, when I, I honestly thought it was a thing on Java, but apparently it isn't. And Among Us, or Among Slimes, the game that they released on Java, uh, it was the first time they had private games, and people were like, holy shit, private games. <laughs> but apparently it's... Super easy to code on Among Signs, but super hard to code on everything else? Supposedly. I have no idea why. Uh, but they were like, we might, you know, add that. Because people were asking it for a super long time. Although it wasn't, like, super prevalent as much as, like, knock back or something. It was, it was known that people want that. So they discussed that, you know, they might do it, they might not. It's not, like, their priority as of now. But that would be fun to have private games and to be able to both test knockback and to beat up my friends and then let them beat me up. Because, uh, you know, that's how friends work. But I, I think I asked, like, does that interfere with Xbox's agreement? Because Xbox's agreement for the servers is that you can't have private messages, but if they have private games, that's like the exact same as private messages, because you can just invite someone to your game and then be like, hey, I'm going to talk to you privately. <laughs> um, but apparently that doesn't interfere, and they, they said that that doesn't do anything, I'm kind of, I'm not too sure about that. Because <laughs> uh, party chat and private chat aren't allowed, but if they make private games, it's like the exact same thing, because it's just a private chat. But it's technically in the public? I don't know. I think that's a weird, like, workaround on their... on the Xbox's paraphrasing on... private, uh, chats. I think that was basically it. There were some other minute points that people brought up. Oh, right. They also brought up the... Um, they were suggesting that they should add a system to where if you're on mobile, you can play with other mobile players. And if you're on PC, you play with other PC and vice versa. And I said that that s seems easily abusable, and they agreed, but they said it's, it's better than um, just letting mobile players being trapped with all these other variety of players, like, uh, to their viewpoint. But to, to the Windows 10 player viewpoint, or the PC player's viewpoint, they can just go on, like, a emulator, or just, somebody just go on Xbox. I'm on Xbox, and I'm using a fucking keyboard and mouse. Be like, hey, f uh, free 15 kills, you know? Like, that's... <laughs> seems super... not... Sick. Uh, 
but I guess it's better than just living in like nothing. But it's still super like have make a imbalance. And leaderboard players can just fucking abuse that like crazy. And just get leaderboard in like two seconds. Technically. I mean, it's not to say that mobile players are fucking, you know, like, brainless. Obviously, there are some good mobile players. But in general, it is just easier to fight a mobile player if you're on PC. Okay. I made the two floors. Up, up floor is for whatever the fuck, down floor is probably for storage. Alright, where are the quests? I completely ignore the quest. Craft the furnace. I can do that pretty easily. Logs in the charcoal. Grow. 38 seconds. Hmm. I should probably start on placing down the dirt for beetroot. Beetroot? Oh, that is not correct. That is correct. Okay. How many blocks wide is this? <laughs> the hems fell off. Double eating sound. Actually, I might. I'm gonna make a tree farm first. It's the easiest one to make. Actually, wait, no. It costs a lot of cobblestone. I think I'm gonna do it to where, like, this entire floor is just like cobblestone generators. But that would be way later on, I just have to. Let's get these. Okay. If it was nine, it would be like perfect. Let's not. All right, whatever. Doesn't matter too much. I'll do it this way. Should probably actually place the uh, where the water would go.
Can I? Can you sell beers? Nope. Alright, I got a snot logs. I keep forgetting there's like quests in this game. It's not just normal skyblock. Although I haven't played normal skyblock in like so long. Because every time I play it, I just like get bored in two seconds. But the point is to like get like find a way to be like, oh, I'm, you know. Wait, when did I have it? When did I have this? Why can't I place it? Is it real? What is happening here? Why can't I place this? What is this? What is this item? Why can't I? What the fuck? I got it. What the fuck is happening? Jesus. That <laughs> Just a weird glitch. Fucking block lag. Two quest rewards. Oak sapling. Craft torches. Alright. Bam. I already did all this. Fuck, I have to redo it. Oh my god. <laughs> it's made so many stone pa I wasted so much cobblestone. At least I have a billion stone pickaxes that I could use later. <laughs> okay, it is really laggy. I, I don't know what my ping is. It's probably around like 200 if it's doing this. Because I played some Chaos Sky Wars before I streamed this. And I, I wasn't having any block lag, but I was having a little bit. I, I just said two things that were contradictory. I had a little bit of block lag. Alright. Hope all of these are actually real. They're not block leg. Block leg. Aww. New island. That way. Aww. That way? Yep. Yeah, I got it right. Aww. Harvest a lot of beetroot. That's a lot of beetroot. Just place it here for now. Even though I'm gonna, I'm gonna add more later on. I'll probably do the thing where I just have like a, st a straight line of 
of that of just be root. Exactly 80? It can't be. It's like in 70 something. This grows back really quickly. Okay, I'm gonna make another chest. Boop. I don't know why it's up here. Just gonna put away all the dirt. I'm going to go to that island. Can I use uh, slabs? Are they broken though? I don't have a staircase to down here. Yep, they're broken. <laughs> Sweet bridge. That isn't. <laughs> Good thing I have no money. Spend my a thousand coins for one more cobblestone generator. Grass box 10k? What the fuck? Oh, potato. Furniture, bruh. Imagine using 3D models. That's such a stupid insult. here. Yep. Can I break this? I think I can, right? Yep. Give me those potatoes. Where's the, uh, coal? There it is. Oh, 
Oh boy. Two hundred oak logs. Next thing you know, gather two thousand jungle logs. Oh, the jungle trees take one day to grow. Okay, cool. There's a little bit of block lag breaking the leaves. Sure do love need to be eating the beetroots. I'm gonna have to come back here for dirt at some point. Oh, okay. The, okay. No, I got a little confused. This is that they were going to add boosters, but then the booster is a real payment. I wonder if anyone got mad at that. They probably did. Or pay to win shit. Although it's allowed, just because it's not a. The, this game is not a competition. You don't, you're not getting the upper hand over another player unless you make it specifically so. So it's it's fine. This isn't real. Few of these aren't real. But that one. What the fuck? Really close. Okay. Do cows spawn if there's no grass? Let's test this. Because in vanilla they don't. But I don't know. Like, I don't know about here. Is it the skyblock hub? I'd probably do that. I'm at the skyblock hub. Imagine not using this container. What do you do? Oh. Hmm. Oh, yeah, you can just repair materials, right? There's no. Oh man. I sure do want to spend five cobblestone on a three cobblestone pickaxe. That's smart. For enchantments. 
Nothing has spawned yet. Yeah, I think they do need uh, grass. But guess what? I removed all the grass, so I don't have any grass anymore. Checkmate atheist. Honestly, I've never done mob farms. Oh, wait, they do spawn. It's just super fucking slow. Yeah, I think it takes a bit for the spawner to be like, I'm spawning mobs. <laughs> Stop. No, no. <laughs> yep, just making some beetroot soup. You know that thing that you know people eat? Yep, we're just making it. Alright, I'm gonna construct the uh, potato part. Potato. Oh, fuck. See, the way I've seen people play this is that, or at least for the mobs, they have two spawners, one for XP and one for money. Because if you want XP, you have to have it be like a higher level, but if you want money, you gotta have it be a super low level. No, no. Apparently. <laughs> Let me actually make a sword. No. Does it do less damage? Hold up, 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 hold up. Oh. Mm. fucked up for a second. No. No. Okay, no. Wait, wait, wait. No. There's two hearts. Mm. Or sometimes two and a half. Mm. You also do two hearts. No. Okay, I'm confused. Okay, no, it's just it's being wonky. Okay. Uh, let me have the potato. Actually, you know what? I will separate it. I just wasted cobblestone, but I'm gonna separate it. Right, there's no... I need to make this. Got it. Perfect. No, no. 
Well, I'm gonna test it now. Someone said at the end of the discussion yesterday that um, sprinting does not deal more knockback. And, you know, flashbacks to my fucking forever of playing mm. Sky Wars, and I'm like, pretty sure that's wrong. And yeah, it is wrong. Right, I was... 8HD, man, you sure are great. I think it's right there. It, it wasn't, but it doesn't matter. Do I have any more cobble? I don't. Can I, can I place the... I have to like jitter click for it to fucking place. Potatoes. Why the fuck am I eating it while placing it? Hello, what is this? Why? Okay, what is it for the, uh, got beef? Cook steak. Alright, I can do that.
It's the, uh, like two blocks, right? Two blocks apart, or no, no four blocks of blart. Four blocks of blart. Mm-hmm. Yep. That's that's what I said. It's for the tree farm. Hmm. Huh. 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 I'm gonna use wood. I usually use cobblestone. I'm gonna use wood because it makes sense. Holy shit, planting this actually sucks. Because I think it's trying to like eat it while at the same time planting it. I think potatoes are going to be our money maker because beetroot sucks. Let me guess the next thing is to cook potatoes. Let's have to do the pumpkin shit, right? Harvest pumpkins. Got beef? Yeah, we got beef. Yeah, I got beef. Yeah, you want beef? Yeah, I want beef. Are right, you looking for the beef stew? <laughs> How much does beef sell for? Raw beef. Seven. Meanwhile, potato, eight. Potato is better. Both in terms of collecting and in ratio. How much does cooked go for? I'll just cook like one. Straight up doesn't sell. I thought it did sell. Like cooked steak would sell, I think. Oh, it actually is an achievement to pick potato. Fifteen. Alright, for now I'm gonna put the coal generators down here. Yeah. Oh, fuck. I 
have to spam the auto sprint. Or the sprint. Spam the auto sprint. I'm hacking. Hurry in, client. Let's go. Actually, I think auto sprint is allowed on Cubecraft. I have to confirm that. I heard of some other that was allowed. But I know some PvP clients have it. Eat the root, bro. Huh. Oh, time to eat the root. <laughs> Boy, this isn't gonna be annoying. This beat root gives you like no saturation. Okay, I actually think I'm gonna end the stream here, because I mainly did this as a test to see if I would enjoy Skyblock again, maybe, and, uh, I don't. <laughs> I mean, I don't know, it's something that, that's, I, you know, if you play for too long, it just feels like a job, and, uh, well, that's what I'm just feeling like a little bit. So, I think I'm just gonna end it here, and leave. I don't know if I'll post this to YouTube. I'll probably post it to YouTube. Why not? It's an hour of footage of me saying nothing for 20 minutes. <laughs> uh, well, goodbye.